We now know what the big scam of 2016 will be. Remember 2012's skewed polls? You know, the ones that all turned out to be right. Well, it appears that the 2012 skewed polls have been replaced by 2016's undercover Trump voters. Because, you know, nothing says compelling argument like saying, my candidate sucks so bad, people are ashamed to tell pollsters they're voting for him. So we've got legions of people out there just waiting to vote for Donald Trump on election day, but they don't wanna tell pollsters about that. Now, this is being put forth by some very smart people for one of two reasons, either A, they've suddenly become dumb, or B, they think you are. Here's the problem with this logic. Number one, the polling during the primary for Donald Trump was correct about 99% of the time. So someone explained to me how it was these polls were able to accurately gauge what Trump's support was in a 17 person field. But now that it's just two people, suddenly they're way off. Come on, man. Secondly, why would someone be ashamed of telling a pollster they're going to vote for Trump, but then show up in public at one of his massive rallies to proclaim their support? Does that make any sense to anybody? Third, if people were ashamed of voting for Donald Trump, then why are polls in solidly Republican states like Arizona and South Carolina close? That would seem to be places where people are perfectly fine with supporting Trump and want to shout it to the rooftops. And then finally, why in this Sam Hill are you trying to convince people to vote somebody for president they're ashamed of voting for? That doesn't make any sense at all. Listen, I understand those of you working for Donald Trump are in a tough spot, but you weren't conscripted into this service. You weren't drafted, you chose it. So just because you chose to hawk his BS doesn't mean the rest of us have to believe it.